Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 1706, where we have 28 moves to remove 53 jelly and reach 74,000 points. Now, we also have evil spawners on the board, and this is always going to be a little bit of a, a toss-up. Do I work on taking out the evil spawners, or do I work simply on taking out all of the jelly? Well, jelly is our only objective. But taking out the spawners will help us reach that objective because otherwise the spawners really do throw out some evil stuff at us mostly licorice twirls which you know are just uh, difficult to contend with so at this point in time if i can make a striped candy to take out stuff here or i can do something to hit along that's going to take out the jelly around the evil spawners because that's a difficult place to reach and uh, hit the evil spawner ones to help stop it from creating something. I'm going to go evil spawner route. Now this is more of a toss-up because it will create a special for me, but I don't have a lot of blue to match it with as it goes along this conveyor belt. I'm going to go evil spawner route again. You'll see how difficult it becomes on this board to do much of anything uh, probably the next turn when the spawners attack. So... Let's see, where else can I get in here? Nowhere, so I'm going to work down low and hope to make this cascading effect. Attack more spawners. Oh, and this is a nice way to attack a spawner. Double hit, I like that. Uh, I can make a special, but I can do this. And now I don't have to worry about licorice being thrown out of this area and i've gotten all of the jelly removed from here now i have to concentrate on this side it's going to be tough because now these spawners are in full force let's see i'm going to play low and take out some of that licorice oh i want those to match up see. Well, this is nice. It's on the conveyor belt, but it's going to take forever for it to wend around that way. Hopefully we'll be able to match it with something. Nothing over here that I can make. So, oh, I really want to get in there. Alright, let's see. Get the reds matched up closer to each other. Take out licorice where I can. And attack this spawner. Oh, so close to being able to get rid of that. Okay. So now we just have this area here, and I tell you what, I have got four lolly hammers, and this is a tough level. So if I need to use any or all of those lolly hammers in order to encourage a successful win here, I'm going to. And this is the tricky part, because I could go ahead right now and, and take these out. Now, sure, I do have a couple more up here, but I'm not as worried about those. Um, or I can wait. If I wait, this is going to fill up because of the spawner. However, they will travel along the conveyor belt. So I'm going to let nature continue on for just a bit longer. Let's take this out. All right, let's see. Got so many red question marks here. I want to know what's in there. Ah, oh, go. Get over that way. Oh, well, close. 
All right. So now I'm, uh, I've got a dilemma. I've only got two moves left. I've not been able successfully to take out these jelly and uh, the spawner could go at any time, but I have lolly hammers. This is how I beat the level, folks. Let's, let's use the lolly hammers. It's better to do this and then to go back and collect sugar drops than to continually play this for 17 weeks. So, uh, if you want to see more videos, you can subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching, and Jermaine, I hope this helps you. Bye-bye.